Okay. Thank you very much to whoever returned the baby. Thank you very much. How do you, how do you feel, Mom? Yeah. baby. Very happy. Real. Satisfied. What was going through your mind on it? What would have gone through yours if you had been in my case, in our case? Yeah. All sorts of things, never good ones, unfortunately. But thank God we have a baby back. That's all that counts now. Mm -hmm. Do you know what happened? Everything seems to be all right, thank God. What about the future with the baby? The wife of the baby? Mm -hmm. I'll buy a leash. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, thank you very much. Where is he going to go now? Is he going to go to sleep or are you going to have a little celebration when you... No. Hi, we're going to have to go back to sleep. 11 uh, tonight at about uh, 11, uh, about 20 after 11, up on uh, Roosevelt Avenue and 95th Street, there's a uh, vegetable store called the uh, Top Tomato. And a gentleman up there spotted the baby walking around by itself, and he saw it heading for Roosevelt Avenue to cross the street. He ran over and grabbed it by the hand and started asking other people in the store, whose baby this is? Whose baby? And he was joined by another woman, and the two of them started uh, asking everybody whose baby it was. About that same time, a call came into the residence. An anonymous caller said, if you want your baby back, come to the top tomato now. Uh, the family rushed out of the house. Just then a, uh, a police department van was cruising by. They jumped in the van. The van put over the air uh, what was happening and the, the uh, basics of the call. Another radio car happened to be right up there at the location and went over and uh, secured the child. And they took her to Elmer's General Hospital uh, for a checkup. The child is fine. And that's where we are. Do you know what the circumstances were? How no, the child got no. There? That's uh, no. We don't know how the child got there. Uh, that's part of our continuing investigation. Have your name and your title, please. Yes, Captain Gregory Moore, uh, Detective Burke Queens. Captain, anonymous caller, male or female? A female. Where, where did that call come to? The residence. The, number the residence. The residence. Yes. So do you suspect that the female was holding the baby and the baby got away and was walking? Uh, I don't know. I don't want to speculate on that. Uh, we don't know. Uh, as I say, uh, as soon as the call went out from the van with the family in it, that they were heading for 95th Street and Roseville Avenue, there was a radio car right on the scene. And a police officer, Howard, uh, jumped out of his radio car, saw the child uh, being held by the man and woman, and uh, took the child into custody and brought it over to the hospital. The child was just walking there? As I say, the child was by itself walking around when uh, this gentleman that was up there spotted it and uh, realized that it shouldn't be walking around at that time of the night. It was heading toward Roswell Avenue, so he went over and grabbed it by the hand and started asking uh, people whose baby it was. Is anyone being questioned from that scene? Oh, well, everybody is, sure. Everybody is. We're questioning everybody. Well, no suspects. No, no suspects at this time. Was the person who found the baby a grocer who worked at the... I, I don't want to go into that. Maybe they want to remain anonymous. Are you still treating this as a kidnapping, though, Cap? Yes. <laughs> kidnapping or abduction. Uh, that'll be determined later. We'll find out the facts. But you don't know the motive? No. Do you know when the husband came home? I know he wasn't at the earlier press Yes. No, the husband, as soon as the, uh, you know, the, the kidnapping, uh, we found out about the kidnapping, we contacted the husband. He came right down. Did the caller mention the name of the uh, the, uh Pardon me? Yes, he did. He said uh, again. He said, "If you want, uh, if you want your baby back, come to the Top Tomato now." That was the message. Was the man or woman? Female. Okay. Anonymous female. By this time, the baby had already been found, though, by the gentleman. Uh, I, I don't know. Just about the same time. What was the uh, time on that? Time about 20 after 11 is when the uh, gentleman saw the baby wandering by itself uh, by the fruit stand. And what time did the call come Pardon me? What time did the call come About that time. It, it all happened almost simultaneously.
pictures. Appreciate it. One of these days I'm going to moon you, you know? My flash failed. I'm glad all those idiot video people were there so I could do available life. I get that.